Hey, this is not a Stim Chick channel. We are here with OCAM for OFN and News Video Web with comments on the headlines of today. And as you know, we're here at the SEMA show. So I don't know what kind of background they're putting on this, but we're doing audio right now. <laughs> well, actually, we're shooting pictures of my feet. Oh, we are? This is the third day. No, but they're getting... Are, what do they get to look at? Are you actually showing the pictures of your feet? Or you <laughs> no, them? they're seeing the auto show. Oh, of course. They get to see the auto show with this in the background because you don't want to see my feet. Mm. Her feet, yes, but not mine. Not your feet? No. Oh, I think the big news today is Oakland is ablaze. Oh, yeah. And uh, here's the trick is, is that this will all come to an end as soon as somebody in the country has the courage to file charges of accessory before, after, and during the fact of the crimes against the President of the United States, who has put the weight of the Presidency of the United States behind all of this. And he said, it works that way. My father was a police officer. My father was given the, uh, the job of when he was a reserve officer because the regulars didn't want it of serving arrest warrants for elected officials because people didn't want to do it so they give it to a reserve officer. What you do is you charge Obama, Obama would throw a fit and then the day he leaves office, which he doesn't have to, you do what he th everybody thought he was going to do with George Bush. George Bush was expected to be arrested by uh, Obama administration when he left office. But I, my guess is there's a lot of people, especially bondholders, that lost everything because of his uh, putting unions ahead of him that will bring charges of criminal misconduct against him when he leaves office. So, Are you serious? Well, basically, there, uh, you, you supposedly cannot do anything, that ch charging with anything that he did while in office that had to do with government activity. So, therefore, if you basically make a personal decision that somebody shouldn't get paid, that's mm -hmm. your decision. You can't use the office of the United States to decide who sh against the, uh, the laws are very precise. You know, it says that people are certain pecking orders. When you go against that, you're breaking the law. And when he tells people it's all right to uh, to rape people, to burn buildings down, to threaten little kids, he there becomes guilty before, after, and during the crime. So. Mm. And the IF Global collapses under Eurozone bet. Yeah, well, because what happened was they didn't realize that, okay, these are Obama, these, you know, these, these millionaires and billionaires that Obama keeps wanting to attack, uh, basically, they're all his supporters. This is Corazai, who was the governor of, of New Jersey, who took New Jersey into bankruptcy, um, that was the head of the company. He bet the, on bonds, and unfortunately, our president has told other people in other countries, don't pay the bondholders, even though their laws all require it. Just pay off the, you know, the, the people you're doing business with instead. So Corazai was one of the bondholders. And... Uh Condition of maroon ship you know, on New Zealand reef worsens. Yeah, and it's just going to keep getting worse because it's busted up. I mean, it's gonna, you can't pull if you pull it off, you destroy the reef. So you have to let it break apart, and then when it breaks apart, you haul the pieces off. Oh. I mean, it's like something. People have been crashing ships on the Great Barrier Reef for 400 years. And deaths from painkiller overdose triple in the past decade. Yeah, well, that's. Uh, because the fact, like I told people before, there are more people alive today than there was 10 years ago. If you have a larger population, you increase the people that die by accidental drug overdose. Oh, is that how it works? I know. And changes in crack cocaine terms means early releases? Oh, yeah. They've decided that it's no big deal if, you're, if you break the law. Laws are for Republicans. And and um, and middle of the road moderates. You don't want to have laws for people that break the law. Remember, the way it works in in the democratic world is is that uh, the lawbreakers only break the laws because people force them to do it. Mm. And the lawsuit filed a Reno air crash race crash that killed eleven. Yeah, because that you know, like I said, it's just uh, sounds like news we've done before, but it's unfortunately the same news. Are you serious? Yeah, well. I mean, a lot of it did sound like news we've done before. Well, what but I know, like the the lawsuit, I mean, it changes. Yeah, you know, what happens is, is that they uh, 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 when they don't have anything to do, they bring the, they'll. They, they bring up old news and rehash it. We're getting rehashed news again, folks. Is that like the car dealership owner derided his Taliban photo wins millions? Yeah. 
so there's nothing we can, okay, what happens is they, they, he didn't get millions because today they're telling you the court, they challenged in court. That was the other part. That yesterday he was getting it, today he's not. Oh, well, what about that Ohio grandmother who spent 32 years as a fugitive freak from jail? They don't know. That doesn't sound like that should be there, but it is. No. <laughs> okay, what happened in that one, too, was they went to court, the uh, prosecutors went to court and said no. She broke oh. the law. She broke the law. I mean, she, bro she got sentenced to prison. Then she escaped from prison. She violated federal laws by getting uh, using false identification to get a false... Um, to, to vote falsely to get a false uh, social security number. Just to, the way it works is she broke so many laws that uh, that there no way they could let her get off. She confessed to a crime she didn't do, so she could get time served. Well, the problem is the crime she did do she hasn't paid for yet. Oh. So she's going back to jail. Oh, inside did Corazon risk taking cripple the MF Global? Well, no, what he did was he didn't take a risk. He bought government bonds, which are supposed to be stable. Uh, bondholders are supposed to be first in line. In, for the gov That's why they sell bonds. So if the state goes bankrupt, a country goes bankrupt, the people that have the bonds get their money back. What happens is, under the Obama doctrine, bondholders lose everything. Are you serious? That's right. Well, that's kind of... Well, that's why Obama, will, uh, okay, Obama cannot afford to be to lose the presidency of the United States because he has basically caused so much havoc in the world, somebody in the world is going to, you know, put him behind bars, folks. Yeah. Analysis, dollars, many woes, complicate Japan intervention. Well, okay, the, um, what happens is that Obama is getting his wish, the dollar is collapsing, but as the dollar collapses, it takes the Japanese yen with it. Because Jan the Japan, who has money problems and prints money to cover things, can't afford to have the American dollar to collapse because then it collapses the yen. Um. Oh. I know. <laughs> UNESCO grants Palestinians full membership. Yep, and Obama could have stopped that at any moment. Remember, we have a guy that's a Muslim president that refuses to admit he's a Muslim because he's ashamed he's a Muslim. But he's doing everything to show the Muslim people how much he wants to be a Muslim, but they don't accept Muslims that are half, uh, half Muslim and half non-Muslim. They don't. So there's nothing he can do to appease them. So that's why they don't like him in the Muslim world, folks. Oh, and Greek referendum threatens new eurozone crisis. Oh yeah. Well, they're not going to have the referendum because the gov. The, okay, this is the ultimate. In, okay, if they don't pass the, uh, if the Greek government doesn't agree to pass another austerity program, which isn't going to stop them from defaulting because they've defaulted six times already, they're going to uh, be kicked out of the Eurozone. If they agree to do what the, what Merkel and Sarkozy wants them to do, the people in the country are going to throw them out of office. Uh, so um, you either do what the people tell you or you do what the uh, French and the Germans tell you. I don't think the French and the Germans elect them to office. Um. Well, Cain denounces a witch, witch hunt and denies sex harassment. Okay, they said that the problem is that Cain is making hay with the sexual harassment charges. They said the more he's attacked, the more money he's getting in and the higher he goes in the polls. But they, I, I love this, but uh, the Democratic supporters, that they said that uh, there, there's no reason that, that, any, that Obama would be attacking Cain because it's Romney they're scared of. Well, any time the uh, Obama people, supporters, say they're afraid of some candidate, you know they're not afraid of that candidate. Mm -hmm. And Kardashian apologizes to fans for failed marriage. Well, everybody in the world knows it was a joke marriage. For They did it for a television show. And, she, and they said she can't get out of this one because it was, everyone said, with that stupid, that, that marriage that was done for the TV reality show, mm -hmm. that it was a phony marriage. And what they're saying is the only person that didn't know it wasn't phony was Humphrey. Because he not, they said he's not a very bright person, but Kadassian blamed it. He wanted stardom, and he just I wasn't going to give it to him. So that's what ended his desire to be a star. Are you a star. serious? Oh, yeah. See, that didn't go over well either. I mean, no, nothing. that doesn't seem to ring true. I know. She's the one. She keeps trying to figure out ways to give her 15 minutes of fame a longer 15 minutes. 
it doesn't work. The, the Gada no one likes the Kadassians, and yet they're still there. They're still there somehow. They're still there. Qantas says flights back to normal after turmoil. Yeah, but what you know? But it's going back. They're still <coughs> said they're going to shut it down. They're going to shut it down anyway because of the fact that the unions aren't going to work. So um, <laughs> yeah. Obama gives a passes to check on to someone else. For you know, my he passes it on to a, one of his campaign donors. You know, the bill for fourteen trillion dollars I spent. Mm -hmm. Said, let you pay for it. Mm -hmm. So. And Darko has the biggest loss on BP settlement. Yeah. Well, the problem is, is that um, okay, BP settled for considerably less than the damage they did because Obama said there was no damage. I mean, the, the government said there was no damage whatsoever, so therefore they didn't have to settle for much. And a Monty Bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal okay. Kingdom. Okay. Uh, you know you're tired when you try to do the work you have already done and have forgotten you did it already. Uh.